when you have a merge request with a failed pipeline like this, um, many people don't know exactly what to do to resolve it. Now, the first thing you want to do is have a look at these icons, and you'll see that it says your build failed. Um, if we go into the to the actual pipeline, you'll um, see that the pipeline is broken up into multiple stages, build, test, and deploy, uh, and we can see that the build has failed here. Um, if you click on this job, you will see it's broken up into multiple parts, and all of them are failing. So I'm gonna click on the first one that's failed, and this should bring up a log. Now, a lot of this will look um, technical and, and it wouldn't be necessarily relevant to, to the actual error for, for the most part. But what you wanna do is look for any message that, um, that uh, can give you some more information. So if we just scroll up here, we can see here that um, it tells us here that there are reports to entries for um, in Nuda Lerva, but nobody is assigned to those roles. Uh, be sure to assign a person uh, slug entry in team.yaml. So what it tells us is that the reports to entry in this case um, uh, has, a, has a value that doesn't match with a, uh, an entry in the team.yaml files uh, slug value. So if we go back to our merge request and we go and look at the changes, we can see that um, the reports to value here was set to in Udalova. However, the slug for, for the team entry for this team member is actually Nadia Udalova. And, and that is why it was, uh, it was failing because it couldn't find an entry in the team YAML with that slug value. Um, so to recap, when you get a failed uh, pipeline, First of all, click on, on, on the pipeline or on these icons here to show you and then click on the failed job and try and see if you can find a, a, a message that is human readable that, um, that makes sense. Most of our errors uh, will have some sort of message that um, gives you an indication of what went wrong. That doesn't mean that it will always be that case, but in most cases you can find um, the message in there.